happy 2018. For my very first video of this new year, I wanna start off and say thank you. Because I've just found out that my blog, lovelygreens.com, has been shortlisted for the UK Blog Awards. Now what that means is that I'm a finalist for the green and eco categories, and the only reason that I've gotten this far is because of your votes. So last month I asked you on social media, also on my community tab here on YouTube, whether or not you would vote for me. And it's because of those votes that I've been shortlisted. The next round is going to be judged by actual judges, so we'll see what happens. But in any case, I feel completely honored and thankful to have gotten this far, so thank you. As a roundup, so a summary of 2017 as far as the videos that I produced, it started off, I think one of the, the more popular videos was my tutorial on how to make a sea glass stepping stone. The next video that did really well last year was my June garden tour. And now being in January and we're starting to think about spring, it might be something that you might want to have a look at. After that, I think probably the most viewed video that I made last year was called Bad Beekeeper. And I basically took you on a little trip to go visit my honeybees. And I hadn't been there for a while, which is why I was a bad beekeeper. But uh, even now in January, they're doing just fine. Um, sometimes when you're a beekeeper, you know, life comes and takes control and you get busy and, and uh, you just don't have the time to go out to see your bees. It's just, being human. And uh, I got quite a few unlikes. I think probably that's my video <laughs> that I've had the most dislikes for, but quite a few people really liked it as well. And obviously a lot of people watched it. Now, one of my goals for 2018 is to spend more time in the garden in the summer. Now, this has been a problem the past few years because I generally go on a fairly low budget but month-long holiday in the summer. And that has been just an absolute nightmare for me as far as my garden has been concerned. This year, it was an amazing trip. We went to Portugal for a month. Now, the last video that I want to share with you as my highlight of 2017 is my trip to the Garden Media Guild's awards luncheon. And I was invited there by Thompson & Morgan UK as their guest. And it was the first time that I'd actually met some of my gardening heroes. Now, 2017 was a real turning point for me here on YouTube. It's actually the first year that I've actually taken it seriously. Now, that started off earlier in the year with an award that I didn't make a big deal about at the time, but it's another thank you that I need to give to YouTube. So back in May, I was awarded the YouTube Next Up Award and there's more information over on my blog, so my experience with that and everything. But basically, YouTube identified me and some other vloggers as potential next uppers, so people who uh, YouTube viewers want to see more of. So they gave us a lot of support and training, and it was then that I realized, hey, I need to make some more videos. 
So in particular, I'm going to focus on a couple of things with the videos this year. So first of all, my, my first topic, I'm going to continue with showing you how I grow organic vegetables here in my allotment garden. The other thing that I'm going to start introducing more and more of is growing a skincare garden. So if you're not already aware, I have a small business here on the Isle of Man and I make and retail handmade soaps and lip balms and uh, other skincare products. And I want to show you a little bit more about how you can grow herbs and flowers and use them to create your own products. So keep an eye out for more information on that and videos and that will be starting very soon. And I, I hope it's something that you'll be able to learn from and also to use because it is such a rewarding experience to grow beneficial skin herbs yourself and then use them in your own beauty regime. Not only that, if you're interested in creating your own small business, it's a perfect opportunity. Once again, thank you for your support in 2017. So it's watching my videos and subscribing to my channel, liking my videos, and in particular, it's leaving me comments. So comments on my videos and on my community tab, it really motivates me to continue to make more videos for you. So thank you very much for your support. Happy New Year to you and yours, and I will see you next week. Thanks again.